there is a very simple idea that solves a lot of problems in number theory it's called parity check in fact we can make it simpler it's called odd versus even let's learn a little bit more about it using this problem from isi entrance indian statistical institutes b stat b math entrance here is the problem suppose you have an equation x square minus 2y square equals to 1 and it's given that x comma y x and y both are prime numbers prime numbers we want to find out how many such x and y's are possible that's the goal how many such pairs of numbers x and y are there that satisfies this equation and in this problem we can very beautifully use this strategy of parity check let's see how we can do that suppose we want to check whether x and y are even prime numbers or odd prime numbers are they even prime numbers or are they odd prime numbers notice that the right hand side is odd one is definitely an odd number 2y square is definitely even so we conclude that x square x must be odd because if something minus even is equal to odd that means this quantity right here must be odd itself if you subtract even from even then you get an even number so this number right here must be odd number which means x square is odd so conclusion 1 conclusion 1 x is odd prime most primes are odd the only even prime is 2 so now let's continue with our analysis we see that x square minus 2y square equal to 1 that's given and we also know x is an odd prime now let's reshuffle this e equation a little bit x square minus 1 is equal to 2y square or we have x minus 1 times x plus 1 is 2y square this is a very typical scenario notice that x is odd x is odd which means x minus 1 is even x plus 1 is even therefore the product of x minus 1 and x plus 1 is divisible is divisible by 4 so the left hand side is divisible by 4 which means the right hand side is also divisible by 4 now we have one of the twos here which means y square is divisible by 4 y square is divisible by 4 look the only way y square can be divisible by 4 if y is even prime right that is y equals to 2 the only prime number that's even is 2 so that brings us to our conclusion 2 conclusion 2 y is 
e is an even prime or y is equal to 2. We are almost done. Now x square minus 2y square is equals to 1. We already know y is 2. So we can just replace it. x square minus 2 times 2 square equals to 1. I will let you finish this problem. Can you find out the value of x from this equation and put it in the comment section? Let me know if you want me to discuss any other problem or any other concept in this particular channel. Thank you for watching this video. I will see you in the next one.